shipmates, uh, please allow me to introduce my uh, NATO Secretary General, Jan Stoltenberg. Secretary Good afternoon. Uh, first of all, uh, let me say how grateful I am to be here to be able to meet with all of you and uh, thank you for your service uh, so far away from home. And what you do uh, is really making a difference every day. And it's great to be on this uh, impressive aircraft carrier, uh, leading an even more impressive uh, aircraft carrier uh, group, demonstrating the US commitment uh, to our alliance. Um, demonstrating the contributions that the United States is making uh, to NATO every day, uh, but also demonstrating how NATO allies are operating together, uh, ships, planes, uh, on land, at sea, and in the uh, air. And you are an important part of that. I've been briefed today on, uh, on the different activities you are conducting, and of course it was extremely impressive to see the takeoff and the landing of the uh, planes uh, uh, just uh, short uh, moments ago. For me, it was a bit like a ballet to see the people uh, uh, enabling the, the, the planes to take off and then uh, afterwards uh, land. Uh, you are providing deterrence and defense for our alliance. Um, this is something which has always been important, but especially now when we live in a more dangerous world, it's even more important to have uh, a strong NATO um, that uh, sends a clear message to all potential adversaries that we are there to protect every inch of NATO territory, that uh, uh, we are there to um, give credibility uh, to the core task of NATO, and that is if one ally is attacked, the whole alliance will respond. An attack on one ally uh, is to be regarded as an attack on all allies. And this is our core uh, commitment. This is Article 5, our Collective Defense Clause. And of course, uh, the, the USS uh, George H. W. Bush uh, carrier and the whole carrier group is an important part of uh, that message of uh, standing together, allies, North America and uh, Europe. So um, thank you so much for your service. Uh, we are extremely grateful. I spend most of my time in uh, meetings, in, uh, in offices, in Brussels and in different NATO capitals. But it's great to sometimes come out and see actually what uh, NATO is about, and that is uh, uh, men and women in uniform like you uh, serving together and uh, sending a clear message. So many, many thanks. It's a great honor to be on this uh, carrier and to meet you all. Thank you so much.